Elsewhere tonight, a jury is now seated in the trial for a teen accused of murdering a high school student and hurting another in Lynchburg. 10 News reporter Magda Lusant has been in court all day for this case. She joins us live to break down what was said during opening arguments. Magdala? Well, at this moment, we are in a recess, but in opening statements, we learned that Austin Rozdilski was trying to buy a Glock-like semi-automatic gun from the EC Glass students. The defense attorney is trying to convince the jury that Rozdilski allegedly shot the boys in self-defense, calling it an underground of selling of guns, using this as a bait for robbery. Rozdilski is being tried as an adult with second-degree murder, malicious wounding, and two counts for using a firearm during a felony. We learned moments ago from investigators on the stand and after the shooting, the teen went home, told his mom what happened, and they called the Campbell County Sheriff's Office, who called Lynchburg Police. Back in May, Lynchburg Police were called to the Meadows Apartments, where they found two EC Glass football players suffering from gunshot wounds. Justin Barnett, 18, survived. Dreon Browley died at the scene. Now, the trial is scheduled for two days. It will continue tomorrow, where we will hear a testimony from the surviving victim. Live in Lynchburg tonight, I'm Magdala Lusant, 10 News, working for for you.